Welcome to Grafana 10.2. Let's dive headfirst into this value-packed release coming straight to you. Enrich your dashboards with dynamic interactive buttons on Canvas, directly connecting with specific APIs right from your visualization. The dashboard's view has been refined. Gone is the general folder, replaced with a cohesive view, ensuring consistent browsing, whether you're viewing 10 or 10,000 items. But wait, there's more. Seamlessly connect Grafana Alerting with Grafana On Call. Ensure your alerts reach the right person at the right time. Let AI simplify your panel naming. As you input data, you'll receive apt titles and descriptions. And when you tweak your dashboard, receive an automatically generated summary, staying informed without the hassle. And now you can easily share your dashboards with anyone. Create a public URL and make your data insights accessible without login constraints. We're working to improve your Grafana experience one edition and enhancement at a time. So now that you've learned about what's coming to 10.2, let's dive into the practical side of things. Uh, I want to guide you through the real world benefits and what you can achieve with a couple of these updates as fast as I can. Uh, so imagine triggering workflows or fetching live data with just a button press right from your canvas visualization within a dashboard. We've talked for years about the fact that Grafana is a way for seeing the state of a service, but not necessarily for going back and interacting with it. That changes uh, in a subtle but very powerful way with the, uh, the buttons that you can put in the canvas panel. So for example, we have a customer that's planning to create buttons to start, stop, or restart servers directly from within Grafana. But there's really no limit to what you can uh, uh, integrate with and the kind of actions that you can take with the button panel. Uh, with the Grafana on-call integration, you can align your notifications and your incident response seamlessly with your dashboarding and the other tools within Grafana. So that means you can go and sign up for a Grafana Cloud account right now. You can set up some alerts, you can respond to them, set up an on-call schedule, and get all the way through incident response entirely within Grafana Cloud. That's end-to-end. -end. You don't need any third-party incident response management tools. And the AI tasks that Quentin just mentioned are not limited to panel names and descriptions. Uh, I've always found it tedious, for example, to describe the changes that I made to a dashboard when I'm saving it. And most of the time I don't describe those changes at all. That makes it tricky for the next person who looks at that dashboard to know what just changed. So an LLM is a really good um, uh, tool for filling in some of those missing details. So in Grafana 10.2, we're not just offering features per se, but solutions to your daily challenges in monitoring your systems, finding out when something goes wrong and fixing it. So continue on through this playlist to learn how to implement each new addition to Grafana 10.2 and all the benefits.